today I wanted to show you on how to use iSpinage to help you um, write a better ad copy um, and the second one is to find out what keywords that are best associated with that, those ad copy and to better il illustrate this tutorial I wanted to use uh, an example and a couple of examples and then um, we'll wrap it up the example that I wanted to use is a small business loan verticals. So let's just it's, uh, uh, imagine that we are an, an agency or our business is, is a small business loan. If you don't already know who your top competitors are within the industry, you can type in the keyword into ISPNH. And ISPNH will show you the top competitors um, on this particular uh, industry small business loans industry okay now I wanted to emphasize the importance of um, of paying attention on the top competitors not the bottom competitors but the top competitors as you can see here the top competitors um, are the one who can span tons of money in their PPC budget and um, the reason that we want to pay attention to these guys are because these guys must have um, an agency to work um, to to manage their PPC campaign or their internal team to actually do that you know uh, fine-tuning their PPC campaign and day in and day out so let's take a look <clears throat> when you click on the on deck.com um, you will see the PPC budget span estimate that uh, we thought we think that they spend about 30 between 30 to 90 ninety three thousand so they spend a lot of money and on monthly basis on PPC budget uh, on the PPC campaign so it, they better have um, a good ad copy and a good uh, keyword and so on right um, so let's take a look <clears throat> as you can see here if you scroll down to the top um, the the top ad section of ICPNS here you can see um, these are the top uh, ad copies and we know these are the top ad copies because we rank them based on four factors which is the day scene um, how long we've seen them the, the how recent we've seen them um, their average ad position and their traffic okay so if we come when we combine all this and we put in our own uh, proprietary algorithm we put we put in some more weights on certain factors than others we come up with 0 to 100 um, uh, scoring mechanism what uh, in, in what we call ads effectiveness index okay so as you can see here the the, um, the first ad here um, has uh, an AEI of 94.35 uh, um, and you can see uh, that this particular ad has been run for 145 days and it's very recent that we still see this particular ad and the, uh, the average ad position is pretty high okay now <clears throat> if you, you want to know like what are the perfect kind of like the um, the keyword groups that should be associated with this kind of like ad say you want to launch a new task a new ad group or a new campaign you can click on the plus sign that um, uh, on this column here so as you can see that the uh, small business financing here um, this this ad copy um, has three keywords associated with this you know um, small business financing uh, small business you know all this basically all this uh, combination here triggers this particular ad copy and you can see how tightly grouped this kind of like keywords with this particular ad copy now let's take a look at this the next one here on on deck business loans um, with the bin the benefit that they want to position themselves as a 10 minutes online application um, and if you take a look at the 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 keyword grouping that they're using um, it you can see how tightly grouped these keywords as well like business loans unsecured business loans and all the variation of um, uh, the misspelling of business loans okay um, now take a look at this uh, benefit statement first of all we just established that these are the top ad copies that on deck.com has been using right 
so you can you can take a look at this 10 minutes uh, uh, online application so it's uh, something to do with the quick application quick filling in that sense right so these are the kind of thing that you, you you can keep in mind in writing your PPC campaign like okay something to do with the you know um, quick uh, quick finishing the loan so it seems like a lot of users a lot of uh, um, um, I mean, people are trying to find a uh, to get a business loan. It it might take forever in the process, so they really want to alleviate that problem with this kind of like benefit, a specific benefit statement, 10 minute online application. Okay, so as you can see, you you just get an uh, an, an insights of what you can get from uh, this particular advertiser, the top advertisers, the on on deck.com. You should probably do this to more advertisers. So let's take a look at. Uh, uh, some of the examples so one more example here let's go to cabbage.com oh they spend a lot more than um, on deck just now they spend about almost half a million dollar on on this particular vertical so um, they you know this is someone that you want to pay attention to for sure again you scroll down to the top ad section here and you can see that um, uh, these are the top ad copy that they're using small business funding and um, you know what's the the benefits thing? Working capital at your fingertips. So it's again, it's like, hey, um, uh, you know, you need money, you need uh, fund to grow your business. Here we are, uh, we're providing this to you. No docs, you know, instant decision. So it's again, it's something to do with a quick um, filling up of an application, instant decision. And then you can see the next one is get approved and funded instantly so essentially it's all about the instant quick uh, quick filling up an application and so on okay and these are the working one again we know uh, based on this ranking that I just talked to you about the day scene last scene um, uh, average at position so we know these are the working key uh, uh, ad copy for them and that uh, some you know with the benefit statement of, of a quick application filling up uh, and so on uh, and um, if you go to, if you click on the few more, what happens is that you can see all of this ad copies of uh, the top uh, advertisers within this industry ranked by their AEI score. So anything above 90, it, that means uh, they've been using it for quite a while and they're still using it. Um, those are the kind of like ad copy that you want to use as your base. Now, we don't recommend you to copy the ad copy word by word uh, but just study on how they structure their headlines the body as well as the um, you know the keywords associated with that you know and you can take a look at them and study them and you can export them into your uh, PPC campaign and uh, test out a new potentially profitable um, ad groups or campaign for you uh, I hope I just showed you uh, a quick way of uh, getting insights about the ad copy. You should probably do uh, more than just two. Um, I we normally do like ten of them. You know, we take a look uh, closely on how this our top competitors are doing, and then we use our um, and we we kind of like use that as our base. In that sense, that way, um, if you do it um, in 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 that fashion. Uh, you will leverage what the top minds in you know um, um, in in your in your industry on how they structure. They they must have spent tons of money um, fine tuning this particular ad, you know this ad copies. You can see that they're spending almost a five hundred thousand dollar for the PPC uh, campaign. So um, they're they're serious about this thing, and you can see these are the working ad copy. There's no reason for you to try something completely different um, to begin with. Uh, you may want to test that like um, after your campaign have reached its uh, maximum and um, you want to try something else. But to begin with, if you want to try something, um, a new campaign or a new task group like that, just use what works in your, in, in the, in your industry and we provide you with all that. Um, all that information, all that insights in your fingertips.